Who did he find? Nathaniel Hart Davis is great. Who is that? He's the judge here. Like, if you go down to the Oaks, he was the judge, and he also, he was the Supreme Judge of Montgomery. A long time ago. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> we just went to his house. Are y'all just touristing here today? Kind of. He goes to school here, and they have, in seventh grade, they have a project where they have to go around and find historical things and uh, do a whole project on it. And that's one of his guys. And so he, we did his house, and then now found his grave. Interesting. His house is pretty cool. Where's his house at? It's the Oaks. It's actually an antique store now, but the guy who's running it, it's just right up on, um... Come on, you live here. You have to know these streets. Oh, yeah, we were just on it. Prairie. It's Prairie Street. Okay. So it's just past, um... Do you, are you familiar with the area? Vaguely. Kind of. Um, if you go back towards like this little center of the town, uh -huh. and you'll see there's like a steakhouse and all that kind of stuff over there, it's right just on the other side of that, and it's called the Oak House. But it's and it's the man there that owns it now. It's an antique store, but he gave us the whole the tour. tour of it. Yes, he built his house with the. I thought this was pretty cool being a parent. He uh, he had two daughters. And so the staircase to his daughter's room was in his bedroom. So if they ever came in or out, they always had to come in. Ah, yes. I raised five daughters. I, that's not a bad idea. I thought that was pretty smart. Yeah, and you got one too, so. Thank you. Get the sticker bushes outside her window. Yeah, that's right. Rose bushes. Do you, uh, do you want to be on YouTube? Sure. Do you want to be on YouTube? Okay. All right. Why don't you stand by the the gravestone mm -hmm. and uh, and tell me what you're doing? Hold on. Hang on. Let me... Okay. Tell me your name. Uh, my name is Max. And tell me why you're out here in the cemetery looking at old graves. Um, I'm looking at old graves because it's a part of a school project I'm doing. They started the new cemetery. Because when a part of the Jesse James gang came into this town, there was a huge shootout, and they both died. And since the people of Montgomery didn't want them being buried with the good people, they started this new one so they could be buried by themselves. Except over the time, it's become just another cemetery. Right here is where Judge Nathaniel Hart Davis is buried. He was the judge here. There's a house, there's two houses for him, and he's a very big name in Montgomery. Um, and over here, oh, this is all so cool. Over here, we have um, that's John B. Addison. He, so, while he was getting home from a hunting trip, he put his rifle on the barbed wire, and when he stepped on the barbed wire, it shot him in the stomach, and so, Whenever the doctor came over, they removed all of his intestines and put them in a bowl, removed the bullet and put them all back. Except the weird thing was, he survived until he was 80. So that was kind of like a huge medical um, achievement. And so this is where he is buried. And I don't know where the Jesse James people are buried. That's kind of where, that's kind of what we're looking for. Okay. But well, if you find them, you be sure and let me know. All right. All right. Thank <laughs> you.